Hi guys, Paul here. And what you're looking at here is the Cyclops E from Asia Tech Drones. It's an EPO and carbon FPV UAV platform. Now it's quite a large aircraft, hence why it's not a typ typical review done on my coffee table. Uh, the aircraft itself measures in at 101 inch wingspan and that works out to 2000 565 millimeters wingspan so we're talking quite a large aircraft so it's geared around the serious hobbyist or professional use we actually considered using this platform in the outback joe challenge that happens in queensland and it's basically a simulated uh, autonomous search and rescue so that's typical of the sort of application this airframe would be ideal for so what you're looking at here is the airframe in T-tail configuration. And you can also put it together with V-tail if that's the option you choose to go with. Now the materials used in this airframe is a really high quality EPO foam, uh, fuselage and wings and tailplane, and carbon fibers bars and boom. And there's also some plywood components that go inside the fuselage that help make up the supports and support servos, etc and obviously some plastic components um, to hold the tail plane in place, etc. So the wings and tail assembly do come apart for transport, but keep in mind it's still a large aircraft, even when transporting. Now, I love the way the actual wings come apart. Essentially, you've got two screws. Just undo the screw or loosen the screw, and the wings just pop straight out. Uh, and the tail plane can also be disassembled in a similar fashion. Now the fuselage itself has lots of room and the EPO moulding on this airframe as I've said is really really nice. Everything just goes together quite nicely. This one didn't actually come with instructions. So I assume they have some instructions on the website or the production versions will actually have uh, instructions with it. So it's really geared around autonomous flight or FPV and obviously you can use uh, the APM or any sort of autopilot like that if that's the path you're planning on going down. Now it's really ideal for mapping and long duration flights. So I'll have a link in the description to Asia Tech Drones. And if you're in the market for a large FPV autonomous flight platform, this could definitely be the go. Anyway, thanks for taking the time to watch this video and I will catch you guys later.